Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet a corner to corner granny square. If you find the videos too fast, you can slow them down by clicking on the gear icon below the video. Start with a slip knot, chain two, one, two, single crochet in the second stitch from the hook. And that will be your first corner. Now chain four. Every row will always begin with chain four. Turn the work. In that single crochet, you're going to make three double crochet. To make a double crochet, yarn around the hook. Insert into this stitch. Pick up the yarn and pull it through. Pick up the yarn, pull it through two. Pick up the yarn, pull it through two. Now I need to make one more double crochet in that stitch. Now chain one, double crochet in that same stitch. Okay, so that's your first corner. Now I'm going to chain four, one, two, three, four. That takes the place of a double crochet and a chain one. Turn the work. Now in that first chain one space, make three double crochet. One, two, and three. Chain one. In this last space, which is the equivalent of a double crochet in chain one, make three double crochet. One, two, and three. Like that. Now we have to make another side, so we're going to chain one and we're going to double crochet in that same space. Every row begins with chain four. One, two, three, four. Turn the work. Make three double crochet in that first space. One, two, three, chain one, go over to the next chain one space, make three double crochet, one, two, three, chain one, make three double crochet in that last space, one, two, and three, now chain one, make a double crochet in that same space. And just pull periodically to stretch these out to keep your sides straight. Now every row will be the same until you get to the center of your square. And that can be at any row. You decide how large you want to have it or according to a pattern that you're following. So you'll go ahead and you'll chain four. One, two, three, four. You'll make three double crochet in that space. Then you'll chain one, three double crochet, chain one, three double crochet, chain one, three double crochet, and then a chain one and a double crochet in that last space. Okay, I've gone ahead and worked a few more rows, and again, every once in a while, you can just pull these two sides. So you can make this as large as you would like. If you're making a baby blanket, just keep adding row after row. And now I'm going to start decreasing for the other side. So I'm going to chain four, one, two, three, four, and turn. Now I'm going to skip that stitch and I'm going to skip all of those. And I'm going to make three double crochet in this chain one space. One, two, and three. Chain one, three double crochet in the next chain one space. And I'm going to go ahead and finish until I get over here. Okay, I've worked until I get to the very last space. And now I'm going to chain one and I'm going to double crochet in that last space. And now every row will be the same. Chain four, one, two, three, four. Turn the work. Skip that space. Go directly to the next chain one space. And make three double crochet. One, two, and three. Chain one, three double crochet. One, two, 
and three. Chain one. And there's my last shell. Come down to the last space, double crochet. And so here's where I started, and I kept working, and now I'm doing the decrease. And you can again stretch these side stitches so that you have this nice and flat. I'm going to go ahead and finish chain four. One, two, three, four. Turn the work. Come directly over here. Make three double crochet. One, two, and three. Chain one, three double crochet. Chain one, and there's the last one. So in the last space here, make a double crochet, and there's how that looks. I'm just going to continue on. Chain four, one, two, three, four. Turn the work. Come over to the first chain one space, three double crochet, and then chain four, one, two, three, four. Three double crochet, chain one, double crochet. Okay, so I have worked until I have only one shell left, which is the same as here at the beginning. I have one shell, one shell. So I want a corner here. So I've turned my work and I'm going to go into that center stitch. I'm going to single crochet and chain one, single crochet. And then I'm just going to slip stitch into that next stitch. And again, you can pull your sides to straighten them out. There you go, that's how you crochet corner to corner granny square. Now, if you wanted to make an even edge along the sides, you would chain two. I'm going to make a double crochet border, but you could make a single crochet border. Then in each one of these spaces, I'm going to make two double crochet, one and two. Go to the next space, one and two. And you just do that all the way around. When you get to a corner, which is here, make three double crochet one, two, and three. And then just continue around making two double crochet in each one of these double crochets. So two double crochet, one and two. So two double crochet in each one of these sides of the double crochets and make three double crochet in the corner. And I have one here that's finished. So again, you can just straighten out your corners and I slip stitch to join in the top of the first double crochet. And there you go, there's your finished corner to corner granny square. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, bye for now.